2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee starting at $42,830. What's new for 2023? Following a full redesign for the 2022 model year. The 2023 Grand Cherokee sees few changes, chief among them is that the off-road focus Trailhawk model is now offered exclusively with Jeep's 4Z plug-in hybrid powertrain. Midrange Limited and Overland trims now come standard, with a 10.1-inch infotainment display with navigation. The 9-speaker Alpine stereo system is now available as a standalone option on the Limited, while the Overland and Summit models can be ordered with a 19-speaker Macintosh stereo. The 2023 Grand Cherokee is a multifaceted SUV, situated at the intersection of machismo and elegance, while the base model Grand continues to offer a package that's altogether mainstream meaning, not very fancy. The mid-range and high-end trims are packed with luxury features and upscale materials that make it a clear upmarket player. Despite this upward mobility, the Grand Cherokee retains its trail-busting off-road capability it is a Jeep, after all. Three different powertrains are offered, including V6 and V8 engines, and a plug-in hybrid system called 4Z. The Grand Cherokee is a two-row SUV. It's as happy with suburban family life as it is trudging through the woods, and it offers plenty space for passengers and cargo inside its roomy cabin. But if your family includes more than a couple of kids, you may find the three-row Grand Cherokee L, reviewed separately, more accommodating, the Grand Cherokee starts thousands higher than rivals, such as the Kia Telluride and the Hyundai Palisade, consider it the Jeep brand tax, and its higher trims are priced similarly to some luxury SUVs, that being said, we think the limited model represents the best mix of features, besting the base Laredo, with more equipment to satisfy luxury buyers, the Limited comes standard with leather upholstery, a power-operated rear liftgate, heated front and rear seats, power-adjustable front seats, interior ambient, lighting, automatic high-beam headlamps, remote start, and more. We'd spring for the Lux Tech Group 2 package, which adds rain-sensing windshield wipers, a wireless phone charger, perforated leather upholstery, ventilated front seats, a power-adjustable steering column, a digital rearview mirror, second-row sunshades, a 360-degree exterior camera system, front and rear parking sensors, and a collision avoidance feature that helps when traveling through intersections, engine, transmission, and performance, like the last-generation Grand Cherokee. The new one is powered by either a 293 horsepower, 3.6 liter V6, or a 357 horsepower, 5.7 liter Hemi V8. Jeep also offers its plug-in hybrid 4Z powertrain, which consists of a turbocharged 2.0 liter inline 4 and an electric traction motor, delivering a combined 375 horsepower and 470 pound-feet of torque. The hybrid's motor is juiced by a 14.0 kWh battery pack. Rear-wheel drive is standard with the base V6, but all-wheel drive is standard on Grand Cherokees. With the V8er plug-in hybrid powertrain, several different all-wheel drive systems are available, including an electronically locking limited slip differential, a trail hawk model with more robust off-road equipment and greater capability features, an adjustable air suspension that provides up to 11.3 inches of ground clearance, and a disconnecting sway bar that allows greater wheel articulation for tackling difficult terrain. During our initial test drive, we were impressed with the Grand Cherokee's compass smooth right and found both the v6 and v8 engines to be plenty perky at our test track our v6 powered summit test vehicle managed a respectable 7.4 second run to 60 miles per hour interior comfort and cargo 
A thoroughly modernized cabin replaces the outgoing Grand Cherokee's somewhat dated interior, while base Laredo models offer the essentials, upscale summit, and overland trims will add luxuries including quilted leather upholstery, open pour wood trim, and high-tech digital displays, the Grand Cherokee is strictly a two-row SUV, but buyers seeking a third row, can upgrade to the Grand Cherokee L, which we review separately, we haven't had a chance to test the new Grand Cherokee yet, but we expect it to accommodate more of our carry-on suitcases than the previous generation model.